Hello and welcome back. We are on episode 18 of Red Dead Redemption 2. Last time we played, we robbed a train station and Mr. Bronte ended up screwing us over and setting us up. So the next thing that Dutch wants to do is rob a bank and I believe Jose is going to come with us or it's his plan, something like that. But someone told me I should do a mission with Pearson, like a robbery or a house robbery of some kind before I do that. So I'm going to do that first. So we'll see where it goes. Today is the day, huh? Yes, we are going to find the body. I just have to remember how to get over there. I want to say it was over here. All right. Okay. Also, I have mail. I keep forgetting that as well. Um, well, hello, mister. Oh, I thought they were running towards me. Let me say now. Hello. Hey there. Okay, here we go. Oh my God. I'm excited. Me too. Okay, let's see. It was a tree near some water. And I saw a little X when I was editing my video. So I'm gonna, I, feel, I have a feeling it was this way. Why is it the X on there now? Cause I haven't found the tree yet. That's what I'm saying. I gotta find the, um, oh, there it is. Oh my God, my God. <gasps> please, please. I'm, I'm begging you. Let there be a body here. Come on. Oh. Is this it? Looks like it. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I think it is. Oh! Did you see that thing on his neck? Um, I actually don't think this is it. Really? Why not? Um, just because it doesn't have like a... Well, let me check. There's no note anywhere. I unless... thought it said it had a letter. Yeah, but I think that the serial killer left a, a note of some kind. There we go. Oh no, this is a runaway slave. Dear Uncle Lewis, I will keep this brief because I am on the run once again. After escaping the switch and the whip of the Pennington family, I was captured by a white man outside the town of Rhodes and have spent the last three months or so in the worst conditions of my life. Oh, he took me to a shack called Old Harry Finn in Southern Lemoyne, where I was chained to a wall night and day in a filthy room with only the barest minimum sustenance. I ain't sure if he was a slave catcher by trade or just plain evil or both, but if I hadn't escaped my shackles, I doubt I would have survived much longer. Now I intend to make my way as safely as possible up to Canada to join you and cousin Samuel. I imagine it will take me a few weeks, but I am determined to remain free and very much looking forward to continuing my schooling with you. I intend to stow away on a train heading north and will post this letter when I reach the next town. Oh, that's so sad. It is. Flip. Is there anything on the back? Mm-mm. Well, damn. I wonder if it marked anything on my map. Like, if I could go find the person that kidnapped him. Um, index. Bounty poster. Lenny. Uh, no. Does not, does not appear so. Hmm. Well, sorry, dude. Well, that was much sadder than finding a, um, well, I guess it would have been sad to find a serial killer body, but yeah. I wasn't expecting to find that either. Well, dag freaking gummit. Dag gummit, dag gummit, dag gummit. Hmm. So the search continues. Yes, I'm just, I'm gonna, you know, I'm just gonna, we're gonna do a little stroll in this area because... I don't know. There's a box. Oh, is there a body in here? Ooh. Okay. Hmm. What 
is that? Aged pirate rum. Okay. Using aged pirate rum will increase your stamina XP. Well, then I say we use it. How about that? How about that? You cannot gain experience from H Pirate Room because your stamina is at max level. Well, that would have been good to know. Now I'm just as drunk as a skunk. <laughs> for no reason. Yes, for oh literally no reason. Oh my god! Look, you see how slow he's getting on this I thing? Do. Oh wait, Midnight is not doing too hot. She's pretty hungry. Have a peach, honey. Because you're a peach. She is. Indeed. Okay, I'm just going to give her another peach because she deserves it. She's oh, like, I'm geez. a big girl. Give me some food. I did. I gave you two peaches. That's a good start. Yeah. Yep. All right, Mr. Serial Killer. I'm going to need you to hide your bodies a little better for me to find. No, he's already hidden it pretty much better. No, but better in the in the in the in in the way that. I don't. Oh, Arthur's really drunk. Yes, he is. Hello. Oh my god, you ladies getting caught on the side of the road. My leg! It hurts so bad! Hands up now! Girl! Hey, you best damn well listen. Goddamn bastard. Ah! Arthur's drunk! Hey, hey Arthur, now you may get out your... And then I'm going to also need you to take a little swig of something to increase your dead eye. Oh, actually, let's just use a little bit of this. Stupid lady. Trying to screw me over. Yep. You want some too? Come on, come get some. You freaking, you need to just run away. That'll do it. How about them apples, bitch? Okay. I shall loot you. Since you're gonna loot me. I know. Oh fuck. Someone's investigating? Oh, here, here, here. Stop, or I'll kill you, I swear. Ho oh, ho! Are you that desperate for a beat? Don't make this difficult. You open this door, hey, and I promise you this. I'll close it. Don't. Mister over there, you need to ignore what's happening. Oh my god, there's another effing witness! Can you guys go get a life? You get back here right now. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Wait, I want to loot the lady. Because I think she's probably, maybe she'll have like, uh, I don't know, something that some of the women at camp want. Thank you. You had a, f oh, she had some, oh, she had amazing, wow. Nice, she had some cigarette cards. Tried everything. Look at her. Nice. Oh. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Mm, sorry, honey. Oh. Oh my god. Don't be mad at me. Are you still drunk? Oh you don't look like it. No, there's a freaking witness back there. They're investigating, so I gotta get out of the area. Ooh. Witness murder. Okay. Well, how are you a witness? You didn't see me kill anybody. Idiot. Whatever. Let's look at this house. <laughs> What do you say, honey bunny? Let's do it. Oh my god. You guys are annoying. Inspect floorboard? I will insp- Oh my god, wait! Is this where that guy was kept? Oh, I bet it was. There's chains. Family photograph. Let's take a look. Flip. Oh, it doesn't say anything. Hmm. Interesting. Newspaper scrap. Let's see why. Two hundred dollar reward.
Is this, I wonder if this is the slave they were talking about. Damn, they're really looking. Get a life, you guys. No. Well, it was a uh, five people murder. So. I thought you'd done more than that before and had less wanted. I cannot confirm nor deny. Ooh, another house up here. We're just in a subdivision now. We are. What's going on, you? Hello. Anyone want to chit chat a little bit? Ooh, something I is going. You had enough, Pa. Enough? All I had enough of is you. We ain't had food in the keep for weeks. Oh, well, you ain't a babe in the crib no more. You full grown now, boy. Stop pulling in your pieces. You'd only gamble or piss it away if I did. You damn maggot! <gasps> Who the hell you think you talking to? You need to learn uh -oh. some respect. This is why my left. Look what happened to you. Pa, there's someone in the house. Nate, go to your room. Yes, Pa. Get on out of here. Get on out, you hear me? Whoa there, partner. Just take it easy. Get the hell out of my house. Now! I am. Well, I don't know. <laughs> After I uh, what do you call it? Loot it. I said get the hell out of here. Oh, he's under the bed. I won't tell you again. Okay, I'm leaving. Be nice to your son. Okay. Well, that was interesting. That was. Okay, then, girl. All right, little lady. Let's stop being nosy off him. Yes. Yeah. Enough is enough. Look, that's a big tree. That is. Okay. Lenny, where are you? Oh my god, wow. Ghost in the swamp. Ghost, I saw him. Oh, Swanson. Let me go get Come some here, Arthur. Spirit. <laughs> oh, he's the... No, I don't want to do a robbery with you, Micah. Fuck off. Okay. Hello, good sir. Well, hello. Okay, uncle. I'm keeping my head. Which is more than we can say oh, for Oh, I was going to get some stew, but I guess you can go first. The jokes, huh? Okay, I'll catch you later, then. A.K.A. get out of the way of stew. Hip. Okay, Arthur. Take bowl. Let's get some. Arthur's exhausted. He's had a rough day. He just started. <laughs> Eat up. It's hot. Be careful. Ew, ew, ew. He's, look how long his chin hair is. No, I'm not coming up there, Dutch. I'm not ready to do your quest. Okay, another one? Am I allowed to have more? Oh, or you can only have one. Maybe only one? I guess. I guess so. Let me say hi to my girl, Mary Beth. Always good to see you. Hey. Oh. So, still glad you fell in with this bunch? I thought you asked that already. I think so. Most of the time. Okay. See you later. I still feel bad about Sean. How, How was I to know? It's done now. No Where me. is Bill talking to me? Oh, he's over there. Ooh, there's a question mark over here. Someone wants to talk to me. Oh, maybe it's Mary Beth. Oh, hey, well. You want to talk? Yes, of course. Always to you, Mary Beth. You okay, Arthur? Sure. You don't look okay. Oh. Hi, I'm fine. What have you been doing? <sighs> Acting like a fool. No, you haven't! How so? <sighs> Hurting and robbing folks I didn't need to. Mary about steep Hi, side. you have been mm. busy. <laughs> well, that's one way of looking at it. You're a good man, Arthur. Underneath, I mean. 
I've lost my mind, Mary Beth. It's finally happened. I, I don't feel in control. Just stay calm and do what you do best. It seems I'm best in mayhem. Sure, I'm no better than Micah. Yes, Okay. Are. Just do what you gotta do and stop getting into trouble. <clears throat> we'll see. All right, good talk, Mary Beth, as always. Okay. Oh, now it's saying hunting with Pearson. I guess it depends on the time of day. Must be. Okay. Because the other one I thought was with Lenny, but okay. So I guess we will go hang out with our guy Pearson. There's also something else I have to do while I'm here. What? And it is, um, someone told me that I could come here and I could pull out my guns. Where's Leonard? Where's Mr. Strauss? I want to scare him. <laughs> oh, there he is. Mr. Oh my god! He's out of there. <laughs> Good stuff. Hello, Pearson! Hope you didn't hear what I just did to Leonardo Strauss. Oh, well, let's put our guns away. Go on. Sure, old man. Ah, enough of that old man nonsense. I'm in the prime of my life. Oh, well, I'm sorry. <laughs> How you getting now? Bored. You see that swamp, Arthur? That's God's own pantry. What are we eating? Venison? Come on, let's go gather some crawfish. See what else we can get. Crawfish? Yeah, crawfish. Finest eating there is. It's not just crawfish. No, oh, there's monsters out there that'll eat a feller for fun. Feller. Oh, Arthur, I thought you were a man. No, sir. <laughs> huh. When it comes to prehistoric monsters, I am very much a coward. <laughs> okay. Whew. Head for those trees across from us, and we'll take a look. On the starboard side. The what? My left, your right. This is a boat, Arthur. Okay. <laughs> Whatever you say. Why did you row? Why am I row? Why does Arthur do everything? I don't know, but he does. He does. Because he's a good guy. Okay, yes. go slow so I can see. My eyes aren't what they used to be. Oh no, the ground is too high here. Keep following the shoreline. I thought you wanted me to go to the trees. What exactly are we looking for? We're looking for low ground and a lot of muck. Did I just hear a gator? No, no, I didn't. Pull us in over there. There's Come a on. big boat out there. Oh, I see them. The Titanic. It looks like it. There's more than crawfish in this water. Stop your whining, please. It's beneath you. Okay. This is the place. Now tell me, Arthur, have you ever birthed a cow? No. no. Man, it's nothing like that, but it's equally as gruesome if you're squeamish. You're really selling this, aren't you? <laughs> Is it this hole? Do you see this hole? Yes. Yep. Well, it's sort of like a natural trap. Just want to stick your hand and watch. <sighs> and there! <laughs> there, you see? Good. Well, seems easy enough. Uh-huh. Let's go find another hole. Oh, there's only one? So, how long were you in the Navy? Oh, years. Well, it must have been a year, at least. Or close to that. That's quite a range. All water under the bridge now. No pun intended. Oh, there's one. Found it. I found it first. Yeah, you oh, did. There. Another crayfish. Oh, I just sent up here some. Get your single one out. You yeah. try this time, Arthur. Oh, come on! I look so fancy in my deep suit. Deep. Get right in there. They like to dig in. The little blighters. I want to. Oop. Search. You're not squeamish, are you? No, of course not. Okay, rotate until you find a crawfish. Oh, 
Oh, I'm going too fast. You feel anything? Yeah, I got some. <laughs> Nicely done. A single crawl. Let's just see if there's any more down there. Yeah, why didn't we check more on the other one? Yeah, really. You know the drill now. There we go. I'm a professional. What did I, I tell you? Oh, I found three that time. Let's try another hole. Very nice. Won't be much of a gumbo if we don't find some more. Mm. I'm scared. I feel like something bad's gonna happen. Get down. Talking of other creatures. There. Those uh -huh. gators. Yeah. Three. And they're female. Must be guarding nests. Oh my god. So gator eggs. Really valuable. Even better eating. I'd love cooking with them. Okay. Okay. Tell you what. I'm gonna sneak over to the other side of them, draw their attention, and then run like hell. I don't know if that's a good idea. I'll see I don't get eaten. You go plunder the nests. Okay. That's your plan. You're madder than I thought. Shh. I thought we were in Sumatra. It's easy. Never heard that line before. Oh, ye of little faith. Wait here, Mr. Morgan. Okay, good luck. We may not have a chef after this. Or a cook. Someone suggested me to do this quest just to watch Pearson get eaten by alligators. Yeah. <laughs> He prepares the meal, then he becomes the meal. They're like, what the fuck is this guy doing? Don't be upset with me. I haven't done nothing wrong. Run! Nothing to see here, folks. I'm coming, I'm coming. Go, nice. go, go. Take us back to the dock. That's what I call teamwork. I don't think I've ever seen you move that fast. People pay a lot of money for those eggs. I'm well, we got like nine of them. They're in San Denis who gives top dollar for them. For millinery, of all things. Yeah, a man of them. quite the character. I don't know who that is. Well, huh. this has been very pleasant. Very pleasant indeed. Very pleasant indeed. That was fun. Yes, uh, was. I must get out more. Is that your idea of fun, is it? Oh, what? Thank you. Here, have some crawfish. I'll give you some of those eggs. <laughs> hey, maybe you could hatch that. Get yourself a new friend. There's a thought. A new reptilian best buddy. To replace Mike, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was nice. Glad we did that. Friends with benefits. That's the trophy I just got. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Can you move out of the way? I am it, Pearson. <laughs> Pearson's like, oh, I thought we were on good terms. Okay, I need to go find the little camp area where I can cook. This might be it, I'm not sure. Fingers crossed. Yes, awesome. <clears throat> I wonder if you can cook a gator egg. I don't know. Good question. Oh, look at this. I was going to say, I have some sage. Don't I? Oh. What? I thought I had some sage, didn't I? I thought you did. Or did you feed it to the horse? Oh, I guess I just need thyme and oregano. Okay. Well. Seems like you gave the sage to the fish. I mean to the fish, to the <laughs> horse. No, I gave her peaches. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about before. Oh. I'll stow this. 
plain. Oh, I bet that tastes very basic and not exciting. I bet. I said it first. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. Okay, come on. I'm gonna run this fire out in the middle of nowhere. This is like the cooking fire. The other fire is where everyone hangs out. Okay. Leaving. All right, Lenny, would you like to do a little quest or is it nighttime and you can't? Looks like it's nighttime and you can't. Marco Dra Dragic? Who the hell is that? Never heard of him. Who is that? Marco Dragic? Let's see. Find out where the hell he is first, this guy, Marco Polo. Oh, it's in an area I haven't discovered yet. Who are you? Are you gonna fast travel? I invited you to visit him at his lab. Not gonna lie, I don't know who that is. Another scientist, it looks like. Yes, Arthur's surprisingly very close with scientists. Yes, he is. All right, Uncle wants to wrestle, and I am willing to wrestle him. Arthur, Arthur, get over here. What do you want? Oh, don't be like that. This is a good one. Yeah, it always is with you. Until we start getting shot at. Well, have you ever been shot at by a cow? Whose cows? It's Drunken Rancher up at Hill Haven Ranch. He's such a flop that we could take a whole marching band up there and steal, and he still wouldn't wake up. And he's a son of a bitch. He said unkind things about me. Oh, you ain't all bad then. <laughs> <laughs> After last time, this could be my make good. I don't know. I need you. You know those two bastards that Arthur buy stolen livestock. Sure, I know them. Um, I don't like them. Yes. I'll give you 60% of the take. How many cows? I don't know, small herd, I guess. 20, maybe? 20, huh? Come on. <laughs> Arthur, quit walking through the horses. Okay, let's mount up. Lego. What happened to wrestling? Uh, we are, we're gonna be. I, I thought it was re wrestling, but I, it's rustling. Oh. Um. Whatever that means. So where's this ranch? Right in the middle of Scarlet Meadows, just past the road's turnoff. Alrighty. Yeah. So how'd you find out about this place? Oh, honey, I mean, where are you going? Saloon and roads a bit. Ow! Poor horse. That was not even my fault. I swear. I literally was trying to move her around the sign, and she ran into it. Sure. This horse stresses me out, y'all. It's not funny. It's not funny. Poor baby. Why am I laughing? Is your mean? So, what were you talking about before? Yeah, sorry about that. Roads? Yeah, the, the barkeep there got some like a fish wire. And a couple of times he's mentioned how this rancher's a fall-down drunk these days. Sounds like he don't know his ass from his armpit half the time. <laughs> ass sure from his armpit, be Jesus Christ. After everything that happened? What do you mean? I mean, that it ain't gonna do your health no good if they find out you ride with us. Nah, it's fine. I was never there at the same time as you boys. And they never reckon on a distinguished old fella like me running with a bunch of reprobates. Well, just reprobates. be careful. Yep. How old are you, anyway? Well, let's just say I was born sometime between the fall of 49 and the fall of Rome. <laughs> and my second wife always used to describe me as ageless, though she did leave me for a younger man. <laughs> oh. well, maybe we should cut you open. Count the rings of whiskey. Now, I'm ready for my retirement, though. <laughs> Let me tell you. You've been pretty much retired from the moment I met you. <laughs> I mean the tropics, you know, the real deal. What Dutch is talking about. That's why I jumped on this opportunity. The sooner we get enough money to leave, the better. Dancing girls with flowers in their hair, warm sand, cold beer. <laughs> That's how I'm gonna see out my days. Well, I'll believe it when I see it. All right, let's get up there on foot from here. Okay. Don't want the horses clopping around outside the window. Come on, let's take a closer look. The hell? Who are these clowns? I don't know. This is the first time I ever seen anyone else here. Let's sneak up closer. What? 
Where the hell are you going? I think I got a plan. Hurry up. I'm doing the best I can. So shut up. Hurry up. And be quiet. Ow. You said he was a drunkard. You said that we could play the fiddle and we wouldn't wake him. This I was funny. talking in a metaphor. Now hurry up. Oh, what's a metaphor? You're a jackass. That's a metaphor. Well, you're a son <laughs> of a bitch. Well, that ain't one. Now, now, now get back to looking out. And shut up. So, what now? I think that you should I act you like you're the farmer. Oh, I ain't so sure now. Christ. I'll take care of him. Are we gonna kill him? Most likely. Do you that? It ain't nothing. Oh, I heard something. Hurry up. How can I hear anything with all your speaking? You are gonna wake him up. Oh, up. Move on! Damn! Ah! Ah! I just want to intimidate you guys. I don't want to murder you, you know? Too bad it went the other way. Shoot, padlock. Boom! Oh my. I'll get him out. Right up next to the house to keep him from running off on us. I don't know. Come on. Let's go! Cuties. Yep. And hey, cutie patooties back here. You guys are not, you know, not included in all this. You're coming with us. Oh, they look skinny. Are cows normally that skinny? Sometimes they are. Okay. You can always see their bones. Oh, okay. Florida cracker cow. Yeah. Yeah. Horse okay, mount my horse. Oh, did I really? Yeah. Good. All right, because I'm not going to lie. I forgot about that. Sorry, Midnight. What the, what the hell? I'm being robbed. Yes. Damn you, goddamn robbers. Come. Come on, Midnight. 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 Wait, I need you guys to go the other way. Oh, hey, I was not trying to come after you. So, okay, good. What's these guys? At least you don't have to kill well, them. Hey there. Yeah. What you got? I don't know. You tell cattle. me. Well, I can see that. Who's cattle? Yours now. Mind your own business. Right. Well, I can give you uh, hmm. 50 bucks. What? 50 bucks each times uh, 20 cattle. No, no, 50 total. This is old Squeer's cattle. He knows me. I can't do better okay. than that. I'll have to move him right away. We'll take 200, friend. But I got costs. Mm. 150. Mm. 75 and not a dollar more. 100. And I don't shoot you. <laughs> so menacing. Clyde, pay your friend here. Mm. What a what? I can't believe we did this. What a waste. A hundred fucking dollars? Yep. Bye now. Be careful out there. This is nasty country. He's right hey, me. Don't forget to put some in the pot. Oh, of course. <laughs> like I told you, easy. Sure, I guess. I'm headed home. You coming? Yes. Nah, I'll see you later. I guess not. Arthur, you got things to get into. This, Arthur. Well, Arthur, you lied because we absolutely are going home. That is so annoying. Well, I'm coming back with you, Uncle, so. Okay. 
Oh, we're back in Rhodes, are we? Where's the mail at? Um, hmm? We gotta pick up some mail. That we do. That we do. Where's that at? Um, right here. Right there. Trying to see where that estate was. You know, the one with, um, that we burnt down. No, I don't remember that. Um, I don't know how to describe it. Because someone said that... You guys are annoying or not sure yet. Yeah, come on, honey. I need you to get it, okay? Okay. Meditation. Snake wall. No, don't freaking eat me, please! Ah. Arthur, do dead eye. Oh, oh well, Ryder. better, you know that? And you were fussing about her earlier. When was I fussing about her? You said, I don't know what to do about this horse. I don't know oh. to think about this horse. Look at how lucky we are. Here we are. It's a place I wanted to go. Yep. Um, I know. I, I complain, but you know, I love her. We have to question that. She's a good girl. Wow. Body. Oh wow. She I guess she threw herself in the fire? Wow. That's horrible. Yeah. Anything to steal in here? It says I can loot her. I don't know how I'm going to loot her. Arthur. She doesn't have pockets. Oh her brooch. Okay. There's something going on over here. Why is there always something going on? Always. What the hell? Oh hell, someone showed up. What was going on here? Yep. What are you guys doing? No good. Oh shit, someone showed up. Okay, well. Bye, horses. It's me, John. It's me. Mr. Morgan. Easy. Whoa. Okay, let me see something. Okay. I'm gonna go to sleep for the night. Hi, Lenny. Hi, Lenny. Arthur! Hi, Arthur. Come up here! No, I'm not coming up there, Dutch. <laughs> what does he want now? He's stalking me. Is it morning time? Better not be. I think it is. Damn it, Arthur, you never get to sleep. 4 a.m. Jeez Louise. 
A time when most cowboys are getting up. I know, and Arthur hasn't even gone to sleep for the night. Oh, hey. Okay. Oh, I'm in the wrong room. Sorry. Embarrassing. Girls can't even have any privacy with you around. <gasps> no, they cannot. Okay, contribute. Ooh, camp funds is actually two hundred dollars. That's good. Uh, give item. How much are these? Let's see how much these eggs are worth. Two dollars. Pearson, you made me think it was really yeah. Small. see we need healing yeah fill up the medicine great and then the food or is the food back there great awesome okay let us see if it is possible for me to just take a little nap Oh, good, I can't. Okay, sleep until... <laughs> now, Lenny. No, I guess not. I guess that... I guess it's not available. The... Will it become available again, or do you know? Honestly. Well. What are we going to get into now? I guess I'll just go talk to Dutch since the Lenny mission isn't avail available. So weird. I wonder why it's not available. Miss L.S. Oh, fucking Mr. Strauss. Oh. Lenny, why don't you want to do a freaking quest with me? He's like, I do, but you took too daggum long. You want to sleep your life away. Yeah. Who is this? Oh, it's Abby. Mrs. Ed. Morning, well, Arthur. Found Molly. Hey, Molly. It'll be okay, Molly. Okay? How is any of this okay? Karen and Sean are dead. Dutch is hardly speaking to me. Oh. I don't know what to tell you. I'm sorry. All right, well, I should be getting on. Arthur's right, then, uncomfortable. Arthur. Yeah. He's like, okay. Oh. You okay, Miss Grimshaw? Oh, oh Driscoll. Pinkerton, is there anybody who doesn't know where we are at this point? True. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Arthur asks people how they're doing and yeah. when they're upset. He's like, I don't know what you want me to do. <laughs> okay, soup's not ready, unfortunately. So we'll take a little bit of coffee. How's it going? Mm. So, so. Sorry mm. So, so. Sadie. Hi there. Awkward. Uh, so, come here often? Not really. Me neither. Okie dokie. See you later. Lenny, I'm about to kick your ass if you don't offer to do a mission with me. I wonder if he's asleep or something. Maybe. Lenny, are you asleep? Do we know where his tent is? No. But we're gonna go find it. When are we gonna go meet that scientist? Oh, the guy who's doing the electric chair? Um, I don't know. They just showed a scientist a while ago. Where it said, oh, uh, I don't know. That's like uh, not anywhere we've discovered. I'm assuming when we go over to that area. Oh. It'll, yeah, trigger. Morning, T. Morning, Arthur. You've been doing good. 
Thanks, Arthur. You want to do a mission with me? Keep at it. All right, Arthur. <laughs> You'd pipped up. All right, then. Well, well, daggum. I was going to say, because um, we do have the option to do the electric chair one in town if we wanted to, but... Okay. You want to? Yeah. Okay, and then maybe by that time, maybe by the time we wa finish watching the... Shut up, Dutch! No, I will not get up there. He's so annoying. Okay. Well, let's go watch a man die. I've seen plenty of that. Yes, he has. Nothing new there. Seven forty-five in the morning. I know. All I wanted to do was go watch a man in an electric chair. I'm gonna take the backwards way into town. Look, Wanda's gone. Oh, good. Okay. Don't jump in the water, honey. You might not have made it if you went in there. Okay. Okay. I hope you guys have forgotten my crimes. Why don't we change? Can I put on a, a mask or something so people can't tell it's me? Good idea. I'm gonna put my skull mask on and change my clothes. So. Okay, Arthur. Do you look good? Where's his mask? I'm gonna put it on right now because it took it off for some reason. Just ignore the dead bodies. I had nothing to do with that. No, I, I definitely did not. Damn executioner's thing. ASAP. Will you move? Okay, sorry about that. Yeah. Unless you want trouble, take that mask off. Oh, they don't like that I have the mask on. Noted. Oh, but now they know I ain't who I am. Just get to the dang thing! God dang it, it's freaking locked. I don't know what you guys want from me! Okay. Get in the cutscene now! Won't you just make it easier, bro? Uh -huh. Yes, yes, yes! We are! <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh god. I'm nervous about this. You're going to be in a better place! Uh, stay calm! Uh, breathe deep and repent! Or you will oh. go to a better realm! Ladies and gentlemen, behold the calm removal of this friend's existence! <laughs> Humane. 
Oh my god. Oh, his life may have been troubled, but his passing is peaceful. Oh my god. Oh, oh shit, oh shit. Well, you got what you deserve. Somebody shoot me. Oh, let's get out. You don't seem overly humane to me. I think it's mighty fine. Mighty fine. No, oh, the guy died? Yeah, that's what supposed to have. Arthur, put your freaking sack. No, the the other guy. Oh, the scientist. Yeah. I need help. Okay, Arthur, you need to put your sack on and get the hell out of here. And I guess now let's go home to Dutch. Dutch Vanderland. I just want to go the, the long way just because I'm scared. Okay? Yeah. Is definitely. a girl allowed to be scared? She is. Who's that? Just me. Dutch, I'm coming. Don't worry. All right, last chance, Lenny. Lenny has nothing to do with me. Nope. He's like, just do the damn main quest. And leave me alone. He doing? I don't know. Oh, oh hey! You get the deciding vote. By what? We take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for yes, us. Yes, they are. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. I just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to do. Oh, I. Before the he year. He always out, says that shit. We are going to yeah. be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Mm, mango sounds good. Farmers. But we need seed capital. And we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive Don't me, yell I at can't Hosea. Think too much about the mango harvest. This is it. Trust me. Arthur. If it's business, well. Business is business. Oh. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. I wish they would have let me choose because I would have mm -hmm. sided with Hosea. Arthur, come on. I love you, you better Hosea. be right about this one. I am. No, you're not. You're never fucking right about anything. I've heard that before. Get him, Arthur. Usually I've been right. Mm. Uh, if you say so. Quit down, Arthur. It does no favors. Oh, my God. Come on. We need <sighs> to go see a man He's about so a boat. Annoying. A boat? We're headed to a settlement called Le Grand. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. Why do we need a boat? So we can attack Bronte's mansion from the swamp. Catch him off guard. Mm, he smart. knows we survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See, I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. Doing a get around a boat don't sound good to me. No, it does not. I agree that it sounds like okay. he'll be caught off guard, but yeah, I wonder yeah. what our plan is. Yeah. Hey! Hey, Dutch. Thank Fuck you. you. What? For 
have taken my side back there. It ain't I didn't want to. Sides. Feels like Jose has lost his spine. <gasps> you don't talk about him. Best move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job or revenge oh. for what happened at the trolley station? Both. Neither. What does it matter? It matters. We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back pocket. He also set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. I understand. We just got a lot of pots on the boil, given all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support 20 people. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? You tell me, Arthur. Is it? Have some goddamn faith. <laughs> he needs to quit yelling at me. Future for us. I know, but 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 when did you become so small-minded? If you'd rather we break up the family, go our separate ways, just tell me. Of course not. This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. So either we're in this together, working together to get out together, or we're not. There simply isn't a reality in which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. Anyway, here we are. Let me do the talking. Thomas, it is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's gonna help us get close to our prey. The other night we had quite the adventure fishing for catfish. Cat sounds fish. good. Mm -hmm. Now, my friend. Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you bringing him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Good. Oh, that was well, nice. Business partner, nice. Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Why not? Shouldn't take too long if we can find him. Be live. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big ones. Great. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh now, Arthur. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas. More of a jester than a gunslinger. See well, two you X's say on so, the map Mr. Dutch. Here. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. And stay on the higher ground. We call this ground, it feels like water to me. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. Got a couple of crayfish traps up ahead. Mr. Dutch, you keep a lookout for company. Mr. Arthur, check the traps with me. This one's empty. All right. I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. <laughs> Mr. Dutch, <laughs> you show you the right fellas to be going after Angelo Brunty? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. Mr. I don't want you to get eaten by an close. alligator. Make sure you follow my line. <laughs> oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. Arthur. You got it. 
You can see why eating in the swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. Peaceful. Nobody bothering you now. Well, Except here. for the night folks sometimes. The mm -hmm. night folk? Yeah, some strange people around these parts. Wilder than the animals they are. Well, this just gets better and better. Oh my god, they are chest deep. No, in alligator water. I got one! Come on, like I said, we need to be lively here. I was checking the traps. I guess I took that crawfish for my own. Yes, so. Is there a difference, a difference between crayfish and crawfish? Because that one said C R A Y. I don't think there is. Okay. I'm not liking this. I Someone could literally it. just take a bite out of our stomachs. Whoa. Stop where you are. It's a gator. Just stay as still as you can. Keep moving. Okay, I got another then. trap by that small island up here. I don't know what's taking Jewel so long with that boat. I think we are all equally keen to find her. This trap is stuck in the mud. It happens. Ugh. I'm scared. Ooh. Oh, wow. Okay. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. What is? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was... No, but only some huge could do this. Oh, fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. I... I suppose this can wait. Let's go. Just passing through. My God, there's no shortage of them. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. Arthur's looking at Dutch like, what the hell did you get us yeah. into? I think we, we all need a good bath today. By now. I think so. I reckon we should split up so we can search both sides. Huh? Okay, Arthur, since you appear so at home here, you take the right. Screw we'll you, Dutch. Left. What? Just keep your eyes open. You are such a freaking weenie. It'd make more sense if the uh, Dutch and him went together since they were new at it. I'm new at it too. No, that's what I said. Oh, yeah. I thought you meant <laughs> the other guy. I was like, yeah. whose side are you on? The other guy should go by himself. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Thank you, Mom. I completely You're agree. You're Can I do it? No, I can't. 
Love the name Jules. Yeah, it's pretty. Hey! Someone there! God, it's so dark. Jules! Hey! Someone there! Arthur, you're all alone. Yes, you are. Over this way. Okay, here we go. Hey, you in the tree? What are you doing? There's a monster. A monster. Oh, and I'm standing in. You here? okay up there? There's a monster. Where? where? Massive and nearly ate me. Hey, where'd he go? It's it's out there. What? A big gator, biggest I ever saw, big and nasty. Knocked me off the boat and chased me over here. You Jeez. must be Jules. Yes. Where is the boat? Over there. I ran. I. No. Okay. Yeah. And uh, where did this monster swim off to? Been up here for hours, poor oh guy. Gosh. Damn. I got the scare. It's over here. Uh oh. Stop. Uh -huh. <clears throat> uh. I got it loose. Go. Good man. All right. Let's get back to the dock. Yes, please, scared, let's scared, go. Scared. Oh my god, is Dutch gonna be eaten? You wish. I don't wish. He just gets on my nerves. I wish Micah was here so he could get eaten. Thank God. <laughs> I'm gonna, so, oh. uh, who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules? We are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was going to be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. None. Ah! Well, what? I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we cleared. You're going to need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. <laughs> You uh -oh. see the giant monster <laughs> long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple crack gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. You didn't see the thing. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Oh no. Pull. Well, rest in peace. Maybe not. Okay. Jules. Shit. He won't kick? No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Arthur, go. Well, quick. What? Hurry, Arthur. Okay. <laughs> okay. Come on, Arthur, go, go. We gotta go save him. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh jeez, I see him in the water. Me too. Oh fuck! Come here. Oh maybe not. Oh fuck. Shit. Where'd he go? Come on. Here, 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 here. Come on. 
I get you, Sim. I got you. Come on. Go back. Oh, God, no. Dutch, shoot something. Oh, oh, Hurry up, boy. Oh, oh. To fire off a couple of warning shots no, no, just to pretend you care. No, no. I got you covered. Oh, oh, God, no. Please, hurt. I'm not, I'm not. I'm going, I'm going. Oh, oh I'm getting tired. Can you stop me? Uh-uh, I don't think so. I'm almost there, I'm almost there. I'm going as quick as I can! Hey, give me the boy! Come here! Let me in, let me in. I'm going as quickly as I can, Dutch. This should be okay. Get in. Finish that. Damn. You're gonna be all right, dude. Okay, let me. Give me a second, Dutch. Okay, it's not letting me do it. It's okay, please. It's literally not letting me shoot my fucking really? gun. Oh my god! It's not letting me fucking do anything! What the fuck? I think he's so going. Up. Shit, that is one big old game. Oh, well, your boy doesn't look too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. You're gonna be okay, son. <laughs> You're gonna be okay. okay. Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. I heard that. Ah. 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 Hold. L2 There's still a lot of blood. Pressure. You need to put pressure on it. Is he dead or did he just pass I out from the pain? Blade. I think he passed out. I think he'll be okay if he don't get a fever. He probably want that nasty water. He probably will. Yeah. We'll bring down a fever. A fever oh, is geez. the least of our worries. Look who's He's back. back. Oh, damn it. Oh, every it won't oh, fucking let me use yeah. my guns. I just want to use that eye. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Normally the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kind of reminds me of you, or You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules has been bitten. Oh, my God. There's a monster out here. He's been bitten, but he's alive. Uh, Just keep him warm. Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you. Garlic Both for of the you. infection? I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm going to head back no. to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys, meet you back I'm here. Arthur. Talking bad about Emily. Mr. Arthur? <clears throat> Old Brunty. Bad man. I know. Kill some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. Be safe. You got Hello. muscles, I think. <sighs> well. Oh. He's taking us back to camp. I see that. Well, well, well. Oh. Dutch. You son of a bitch. What do you do? He's not even a camp. 
Let me see if I can fast travel. Because I've never used it before. I was so excited to get tra fast travel, and we've never used it. Wow. About time. Molly, did Dutch yell at you? Yeah, I'm guessing he did. Oh my god. Oh, it's just Uncle. I thought he was dead. <laughs> Uncle doesn't even get a bed. No, he doesn't. He just he passes gets... out anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, well, well. Okay, let's see how we fast travel. Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm so oh here we go. Slugra. I think I think that's where I need to go. Let's hope I'm not fast traveling to the wrong place. What are you doing, chasing Dutch? Yep, yeah, going find Dutch. I hope he's at Lagra, because that's where we're going. I can get a nice little cinematic. Cinematic what? Cinematic Montage. Montage, okay. Okay, honey, don't get eaten by an alligator, okay? Actually, come here. Get a little closer. You're making me nervous. Okay. So, Dutch, what's the Tahiti like, anyhow? Arthur, there you are. Come on. Thomas, let's get going. Right you are. Oh, jeez. Lock is on a little boat. Sure, a lot of camp members, too. <laughs> hey, Bill, you were a sharpshooter in the cavalry, weren't you? What? When we get there, maybe you could help with the suppression fire. I never said I was no sharpshooter. Oh, that's right. W what was it? The nation's most loyal latrine digger, wasn't that it? <laughs> yeah, well, I fought, and I fought well. So you always tell us. You taught me something you could do with learning. <laughs> Them Indians were savages. Watch your mouth there, boy. Watch it. Ooh. Only type of savage in these parts are moonshine, swilling, pompous, inbred locals. Dutch, I saw things out there. I don't doubt you saw things, Bill, but your tiny little mind was too small to comprehend what you saw. What you saw was people who lost everything to savagery, savagery of peasants. Failures come from Europe to reap some awful vengeance on God's last creation. Interesting hey, way Dutch. you boys got to prepare for a killing. I'm sorry I wasted my life trying to teach you boys. Love you though, I do. <clears throat> well, like leaving love aside, <coughs> you think we got this? Don't you never leave love aside, Arthur. It's all we got. Nope, alligator. Okay, guys. Hey, you pick us up yonder. I got you. Thank you. Good luck to you. Thank you. Come on. Got my good one out. Oh, shock. Okay. Wait, let's see. Oh, good. I got both my good guns. Nice. That's great. Quiet. Gun over here. Ooh. Lenny, why'd you push me? Lenny, Bill, you're with me. Arthur, John, you take the left side. If you see a shot, you take it. Okay. Okay. Good luck, gentlemen. Arthur, let's go. I'm literally ahead of you, John. <laughs> let's go. Oh, I'm following John. John, let me follow you. There we go. Oh, you're just walking. You don't even care. I was gonna say, this seems a little silly. <laughs> Find some cover. Two up ahead. Have you got a shot? No. Something creepy about these statues. <laughs> you don't like naked women for your wife? Yes. It's like someone's looking at you and Can I respond to you, John? So just shoot? You just want me to shoot? I feel like this is silly, but... Arthur, you need 
some freaking stuff already. Disappointing Shania. Yes. Oh, I'm shooting the wall, huh? Embarrassing. Can you get out of the freaking cover right there? Snack first. Your snack times are awfully inconvenient. Yes, they are. Okay. They're like Arthur. God you didn't even share. Okay, come on. He definitely did not eat two shots of a shotgun. Really I just realized. Did. Name your price, every man of a price. Eh? Okay, okay, no, I surrender. I surrender. At boom. Boom. boom! Nah, let's take him to Dutch. Unique gun, where is it? Is it right there? Are you laying on I top ain't of it? I'm touching that piece okay. of shit. Okay, I will touch the piece of shit, but I just want to pick up his gun. Okay, can you get can you get off to the other gun, mister? Oh my god, let me loot it. One second. I wanna I wanna get that gun. Oh, there it was. Okay, right? Drop for double action revolver pistol. Sure. Right? It's a unique gun? No. That's the unique gun. Give me my pistol bag. Do you think that's the new unique one? Maybe. Weird. Okay, let's go. A fake Dutch wants to have a little chat, Mr. Montaigne. 
Oh shit. Cops are here. That's so funny that the cops start right whenever I. I'm coming! Oh! Hey! Please don't mind me. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Should I be doing something right now, you guys? I don't know. It's not From where I'm sitting, you're the one deserving of pity, my friend. <laughs> all your men, all your money, it weren't no match for a bunch of bumpkins. You are nothing. You do nothing. You mean nothing. You stand for nothing. Me, I run a city. <laughs> and when the law catch up to you, you will die like <laughs> nothing. I am this country. You, you, you are what people are running from. I possess things that you will never understand. You don't even possess your own men. A thousand dollars to the man who kills him and sets me free. What are you gonna say now? They are even bigger fools than you. No doubt. The law will find you. Already, the dogs are on the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're right. You are so right. right. They are good at smelling filth, huh? So oh. filth! has got to be disposed oh, of! Oh, Our friends of oh, oh, are gonna come and rescue you, you uh, repulsive little maggot! Oh, to hell! Oh, oh, oh. Call them now! You call them! Oh! How's he gonna call them? Why did we? Jesus. Why did we kidnap him? Why did the philosophy books cover Venafell, the goddamn alligator, Dutch. The part that covers weakness. Why did we kidnap him if we were gonna do that? I know. I don't know. Well, I do. It ain't nice. I know it. But it is us or him. I figure it might as well be him. Okay. Well, alrighty. Dutch's, I mean, Arthur's got a lot to think about. Yeah, he does. Guys, after Jill? walking around the house, I'm finally here. Oh, wow. The bank. Karen, Tilly, Abigail, I sent them all. They all say the same thing. There's no more than one armed guard. And the police? It's a city. There are police. But as far as we can tell, the patrols will all be going this way when Abigail and I cause the diversion. That's the opportunity. What do you think, Arthur? I don't see we have a lot of choice. We linger around here, we know we're dead. But the plan? We got a decent bunch. We know how to fight. The 
The city cops don't seem so tough as long as we move fast. I reckon doing it in the day with a distraction. If that's what Jose is saying. It's as good a plan as any. I, th I think I agree. When we do it at night, there's the dram of just getting into the bank. Can't do that silently. They'll pick us off far easier. I know. I'm, I'm just making sure. Every plan is a good plan if we execute it properly. Every problem we had was because we did not execute properly. Even Blackwater, from my understanding. You're right. Let's rob this bastard. Everyone get some rest. We ride out in the morning. Yeah! Oh, good. Arthur needs Travel the rest. Light. All right, Mama. <gasps> you got everything, Arthur. Arthur sure. looking now, good. We rob ourselves a bank, and within six weeks, we're living life anew in a tropical idol, spending the last of our days as banana farmers. Let's get out of this godforsaken place and go rob ourselves a bank. Woo! Let's hope Micah dies. Come on, Jose, get moving. <laughs> Gold. <laughs> Sir. Sorry. Oh, this that was is Micah, it, so gentlemen. Actually, okay. The last one. Where have we heard that before? Well, what goodbye, Bonnie. I never job. found you. I you wished I would, but heart. what can you do? I'm just trying to stay real about this. all this. Real. Oh, how I detest that word. So devoid of imagination. How soon are we shipping out? What are you doing? Sorry. Soon as we get a passage organized, boat down to Argentina, then another around the Cape. What about the money in Blackwater? We're just gonna leave that behind? Forget that. It's gone. You all talk like it's the only goddamn money in the world. We're gonna take that and more. Take it from the people who take it from us. This isn't some Big town, hundred dollar operation. This is a big city bank. Right. With security, guards, police. Hosea has done his reconnaissance. We've been over this. The plan. One last time. I'm sorry. Not to cut you off, Dutch, but I gotta eat something. Hosea and Abigail draw out the police. We go in calm and fast. Let's see. I need to eat some meat. Whatever, I'm just gonna eat that. Doesn't matter. Lenny, secure the front doors. Javier takes the side exit. Bill, Micah, and Charles control the crowd. Mid what is Arthur gonna do? Me and Arthur oh. deal with the bank manager and vault. Okay. Gentlemen, let us go ahead. How long do you need? Not long. Fifteen minutes or less. You'll know by the noise. Any problems? We'll see you in camp. Good luck, gentlemen. Right on! Yeah! Yeah! Everybody know yeah. the grill. We head in hard and stay calm. They won't be expecting us. Any minor trouble, head back to camp. We'll leave in a few days. You good, Bill? Sure. Then right on with Charles. We don't want to be seen heading in like some posse of country outlaws. This is it, <laughs> cowboys! One more time! Now, one well, can we stop time. yelling it? Let's ride! Yeah! They're pumped. I wish I had a hat. I want to get it. little outfit. Why don't you get it? Okay. Oh, oh. okay. God dang it, I put on a freaking country hat. It doesn't match his outfit. At least it hides his face better. Oh, I thought you meant because he's ugly. I was like, why would you want to hide his face? Calmly does it, fellas. Act normal. Act very normal. Nothing to see here, folks. Nothing to see here. Thieves, it ain't no crime at all. Folk like this, they stole what this country could have been. Stay cool, fellas. 
Act natural. Wait for Hosea to do his thing. Hmm. This, this had better work. Looks like there's law over the other side. Have a modicum of faith, John, will you please? Soon as we get out, load everything onto the wagon here. Okay. <laughs> I love that Hosea! Me too. A true <coughs> okay. Oh god! Arthur's getting caught up. <laughs> Ew, your hat's so ugly, Arthur. Not ugly, it's a nice hat, but this with this outfit. Yes. Yeah. Like Let's go! Ladies and gentlemen, this is a hold up! Don't do nothing stupid! Who are you gonna ask? Sure. Who do you think you are? Okay, now then, Arthur, would you please have Senior Bank Manager here open up the vault? Yep. I'll do it. I know you will. You gonna hurry up? Open the vault! Come on! I don't think that's helping right there. Nope. Okay. Thank you, kind sir. Alright. Arthur, you're with me. Let's clear this out. Forget yep. all the drawers, just get I need the combination open. for these safes. Okay. Come on, speak. Speak or die. Now. First number. Nineteen. Got it. Okay, now, what's the second number? 72. Alright, should be one more number. Last number. Come on! 54. You get that, Mr. M? It's not working. 54. Yep. It didn't work. What? Yes, I'm okay, working okay, on go. it. Would you look at that? Holy shit, they weren't joking. Woo! Alright, Arthur. Dutch. Mr. Milton, <clears throat> let my friend go, or folks, they are gonna get shot unnecessarily. Your friend? <laughs> Why would I do that? Come on, Milton. It's over. No more bargains, no more deals. Mr. Milton, this is America. You can always cut a deal. I've given you enough chances. Come on. Don't. Telling him this isn't a good idea and him not fucking listening. No. No. 
I just sitting there not I know, right? Come on, or get behind the wall, please. Another whatever it's called. Machine gun. Yep. Whoa! I shot him right in the eye! That'll do it.
We lost John. Killed? Arrested. I couldn't help. Well, we better go. We'll be next. What you think? I reckon me and Lenny try and find a way across the roof. See if you'll cover us. Sure, sure. Go on. Oh my god, dude. This is such a clusterfuck. Yeah, it is. Oh, careful! <gasps> oh my god! Fuck! God dang it! God damn them! God damn you, Dutch! So annoying. Why can't like literally one at a time, Arthur? You go next. Come on, follow me. Keep it down. There's law everywhere. You got the law below. Watch out. What about the rest of the gang? Okay, good. I don't believe it. They knew we were coming. Just like your fairy job in Blackwater. Ain't nothing like that. What now? I don't know. I don't. This whole town is filled with cops. Well, how long are we gonna stay here? Uh, a few hours? We go back to camp, they're gonna get every last one of us. I know they're gonna be watching the roads. I got it. A boat. What you mean? We stay here till nightfall. Then we sneak on down to the docks. We get ourselves out of here. Yeah, where? Any place will do. That's all I got. What a dick. You can send a poor Dutch. We lie low. We come back for the rest in a few weeks. I'm guessing it's that. We die out there right now. Exactly. Now, everybody, calm down. I mean, oh. look at us. I wish Dutch would shut up. I can't even believe that. I know. Okay, follow me and keep your heads down. Someone's coming. Duck. Hi. Put your big ass head down, Dutch. Oh, Arthur. What I don't you? see why we have to check the train. They just robbed Lemoyne National Bank. It's not like they're gonna take the first line out of town. Well, 
Milton said. Milton said a lot. Come on, I don't want to be out here all night. Arthur and Dutch, get your heads down. <laughs> They're just looking for trouble. They are. Press to attract the guards while out of sight. Okay. No? Okay. I would rather you hide right here. Okay, well, whatever. Jake, is that you? Dutch, how the fuck am I supposed to follow Dutch? Oh fuck me. Quick, get covered, stay out of sight. Thank God they're blind. Yeah, really, but you ain't the light. I need to take a little swig of something really quick. Something. <laughs> Barely got anything. Oh, cigar, that's good. Dutch, are you over here? Yeah, he is. See them? Sure. What you think? I don't know. They're watching for us. Maybe. Maybe not. Well, they ain't just waiting there for no reason. Yeah. Let me think for a second. I'll deal with them. What? How? I can't kill all of them silently. So, when they chase me, you go the other way. What are you talking about? You heard what I said. Yeah, real brave. What in the hell? Who is... Excuse me! Buddy! Hey, stop! Stop, stop! That is one of the most beautiful no, acts even. I ever saw. Come on. We know how to ride a boat? I mean, drive a boat? I hope so. Uh oh. <laughs> Silver outfit. I know it looks terrible. That's Micah. I look silly for this uh, mission. <laughs> Wonder what he's thinking. <laughs> what now? So, what, did Charles well, make it with boat. us? I'm sure. Maybe he's gonna go back this to the camp. This boat ain't going to Tahiti by any chance. I don't know. John, Lenny. Jose. So is John dead? That wasn't good. Or did he get know. like arrested? arrested. So what are you gonna do Sorry. now? <coughs> Guess I'm gonna introduce myself to the captain. Give him some of this gold to secure his silence. He can and find him. out where we're heading. How do I look? Like a shifty, no good killer on the run from yeah, the law. Yeah, you look crazy. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Excuse Listen. me, sir. Hey, who are you? Forgive me. A stowaway. Can I see the captain, please? I come in peace. I know, Arthur. How do we get in this situation? Well, it's going to take a little more gold, but I think we're going to be okay. This captain, he is a, a fine fella, a New Englander from the Cape. 
The rest of the ship is Frenchmen. They're heading down to the islands, taking some Pennsylvania coal. Now, apparently, we're gonna be able to slip ashore in northern Cuba in a couple of days. That's so. Apparently. Well, they're you're far telling, from camp. I know, you're telling me I'm stuck with Dutch and no other camp members? What are members? we gonna do in Cuba, Dutch? Oh, okay. Hold up for a while, then hurry back, gather up the rest of our families. At least we got some money now. Money and loyalty. With that, you can do whatever you please. So you reckon they'll follow us to Cuba? Like Colonel Waxman on a jolly? I highly doubt it. I reckon we hold ourselves to ourselves and this is done and dusted. Let's hope so. I ain't no sailor, but uh... <clears throat> that cloud look like good news to you? Like, this is a turn I was not expecting. Totally. I know that's the least of his worries, but... Yes. Arthur, maybe you should have just married Mary. You know, got out of this life. <laughs> Oh, 
Come on now, Arthur. Alright, he sure is taking his time I walking. Know. Yeah, no rush. I don't know if anybody lived or not. I know, seriously. Is Arthur the sole survivor? And I bet Dutch had the damn money. Oh yeah, that shit happened. But I'm been. sure he grabbed it. Yep. And it probably sunk to the bottom of the ocean. Dude, I hate it. It didn't even give us enough time to like feel Hosea's death. I know. Like it showed it and then it was like shocking and then I had to freaking shoot. Yeah. Same thing with Lenny. But I guess that would be the life of an outlaw. You don't have time to react to it. Yeah. Looks like I am alone on this island. It does. What are they gonna do besides walk? I know, seriously. We get it, he had to walk a long ways. <laughs> Somewhere along the way he took his shoes off. Yes. Oh. And good night, Arthur. Oh, his curly mustache still looking good. Chapter 5. Quarma? Is that a G or Q? It looks like a G. G. Okay. Um, I, I cannot believe Hosea died. I'm not going to lie. We thought he was going to die of some sickness because ever since the beginning of the game, he's been doing this like inconspicuous little cough. So we really thought he was going to die of that. I did not expect him to die in that scene. No. Um, or Lenny. Lenny, I know. Uh, now I'm freaking surra we're surrounded by freaking annoying people. Dutch, Micah. Bill's fine, and I like Charles and Javier. And John's arrested. John's arrested. No, we don't have any of the girls with us. Wow. And that, I don't even know. Okay, so what was your favorite part? Um, The bank heist. Me too, I guess. And I love how everything went wrong. You love that? Yeah. That's crazy. It was interesting. Uh, I'm trying to think of, yeah, I guess that was my favorite too. Um, It was fun doing the little mission with Pearson though. Yeah, it was. That was cute. Um... Well, wow. I don't know where this is going, and I'm excited to see, but I'm also very shocked. Yeah. I did not expect us to, I did not expect the game to go this way. So, I guess we will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. What are we doing, this last mission? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. You got somewhere to be? Yeah, nap time. That's priority. Nap time over Arthur Morgan. Yes. I'll be sure to tell him. Arthur comes in second. Or third. Not good enough. Snack time's important too. Snack time is important. Crisp o'clock. <laughs> yes.